Hello and welcome to another session on speed math. Guys, last time we were doing uh, multiplication of two numbers near 1000 and those two numbers were less than 1000. Now we are going to see the case 2 where the number of or the, both the numbers are greater than 1000. Okay, so A into B we are performing and A is greater than 1000 and B is greater than 1000. Now in this case when I say greater than 1000, I am not talking about numbers like 1576 or 1, 2, 3, 9 and all that. No, they have to be near 1000, close to 1000. Now the nearness is very subjective term that depends on how fluent you are with multiplication. So uh, we will be restricting it to let's say, you know, 100 or 1000 to 1020, let's say maximum like this. So then it becomes easier for us to do the or perform the multiplication. So let's take examples and understand. Likewise, we did it for the case of 1000 here also. We will be or for the case of 100, sorry. We will be doing the same thing here. Now, how far is this from 1000? So plus 4 and this one plus 5. But only thing we have to remember in this case is we have to allocate 3 places for 100s, 10s and units place of the product. Now, how to get those? So multiply 4 times 5 is 20. So simply write 20. And since there is nothing, so you'll write 0. Okay, so that's done. Rest is as we have been doing so far 1004 plus 5, that is 1009. So the product of this two, those uh, three digit numbers, two three digit number is 1009020. Let's go ahead and take another example. This was example number one. Let's take example number two. Let's say we are multiplying 1001 with 1007. Again, how away from 1000 plus 1? How away from 1000 plus 7? Since it is more than 1000, we are taking positives. You had seen in the previous session when it was less than 1000, we were taking negatives, right? Now multiply again. So what will you get? 1 times 7 is 7. But here, we will be writing 007, the bond 007, isn't it? So 007, correct? This is done. And then simply this or this. So it is 1008. So 1007 plus 1 is 1008. And you simply write like this. So this is the product. Clear. Third one. Let's take another example. So as many you, you know, questions you will tackle, you will become more and more fluent. 1009 and 1016. Now these are little bigger numbers as compared to the previous ones. So now knowledge of tables will be little handy. So 9 and 16 are away. You know, they are away 9 times or from uh, by 9 from 1000 and 16 from 1000 again. So multiply 16 times 9 again 144. All three digit num numbers are there. So no, not to worry. And now simply add this. So this is 1025 and this is the product. So you are doing multiplication so fast. Okay, another one. Let's take another one. So let's say you have to do 1012 and 1015. Right now numbers are a little bigger. So again, plus 12 plus 15 but still manageable so 12 times 15 is 180 so write 180 and 1027 done right so 105 1015 plus 12 is 1027 which i'm writing here so this whole is the product okay i think this is you know uh, making sense to you and one last one we'll take so a little bigger 1019 1011 okay i have to do this so this is plus 19 this is plus 11 so if you multiply 19 times 11 is nothing but 209 and if you do this sum so you'll get 1030 so the product is 1030209 so you are able to handle such big numbers and you are able to multiply very quickly so you, you can practice few more from our practice session and you'll get to see that uh, these calculations are becoming so easier for you okay in the next session let's take the case where one number is lesser than thousand one number is more than thousand 